Hello techies, welcome to TechBlooms. In this video, we're going to learn how to construct a NAND gate using the transmission gate. So I have already done pre uh, some videos on uh, OR and TechTem. Please watch uh, through TechBlooms. Now here we have a uh, NAND gate. So basically how we are going to construct a NAND gate using the transmission gate is that this is a basic logic diagram of a transmission gate where we have the input A and the output Y and you have the control signal B. Now, now the number of the transmission gates to be used while constructing an uh, AND gate is basically depends upon the inputs. Now basically we have here, this is a two input uh, through table, so we will be having two inputs, that's why we have two transmission gates, that is transmission gate 1, transmission gate 2, okay. Now based on the input we will be designing the circuit. Now here you can you can see that we are assuming one of the input as control signal, so that control signal we are assuming it to be B, you can assume it had to be A also, it depends upon your choice. So basically now here when we assume B as a control signal, we will assume this as B, this as B bar, okay, this has to be B and this has to be B bar, okay. Now, when we are when this uh, transmission gate will be activated only when B is equal to 1, this will be activated when B is equal to 1, this will be activated when B is equal to 0. So, where are the, uh, there are two combinations when B is equal to 1. One is this and one is this. What are the outputs 1 and 0? When it is 0, when A is 0, Y is 1 and when A is 1, Y is 0. So, it is basically inversion. So, basically here you have to connect A with a not. That's it. So, this uh, satisfies the first two conditions. That is when B is equal to 1. When B is equal to 0, this transmission gates will be activated and these are the other two combinations which are remaining. That is B is equal to 0. What happens when B is equal to 0, irrespective of A value, your output is going to high as you can see here. Output is going to high. So, we will directly connect this to plus 5 volts. So, this is the basic construction of NAND gate using transmission gate. Hope you find this video helpful. Please like, share and subscribe TechBlooms. Until next time, happy learning.